celebrating Christmas and Hanukkah? A gay couple looking to adopt? Not all Hallmark movies are what they seem. Here are the ones that stand out. A Kismet Christmas is a cozy, fun, and genuinely interesting Christmas movie about a children's book author named Sarah who returns to her hometown and reconnects with an old crush. Sarah is played by Parenthood star Sarah Ramos. All of that sounds pretty straightforward, but what sets A Kismet Christmas apart from other Hallmark Christmas movies is the kismet element. Sarah finds out that a family legend, which may or may not involve magical cookies, may be revealing itself in her life. The plot is engaging and less predictable than some other Hallmark movies, and the acting is believable. IMDb reviewers loved Ramos's acting and appreciated the chemistry between the main character and her love interest, Travis, played by Carlo Marx. Despite its average ratings, this movie will make a fun and heartwarming addition to your must-watch Christmas movies list. A Christmas movie with a dog as the main character? Immediately obsessed. A Dog Named Christmas, which is based on the novel of the same name by Greg Kincaid, has a pretty self-explanatory title. The story centers around a dog named Christmas and a developmentally challenged teen named Todd, played by Noel Fisher. Todd loves animals and wants to help raise awareness about the local animal shelter's adoption program. This one. I want this one. What really makes this movie a winner is that it's emotional without veering into cliché, and the actors do a great job of portraying real, believable characters. It's a Christmas movie, sure, but it's also a movie about family, community, and the special bond between people and their fur babies. This Hallmark movie really checks all the boxes. It's festive, adorable, and wholesome, and will give you all the warm and fuzzy Christmas feelings. One IMDb reviewer called the movie, one of the most heartwarmingly beautiful movies I've ever watched. Another wrote, this cast deserves an Oscar. Don't forget the dog, he can have two. Christmas Under Wraps is for the most dedicated Hallmark fans, the ones who know and love the Hallmark movie equation of small-town vibes plus budding romance plus solvable problems equals happily ever after. Starring Candace Cameron Bure, the movie centers around a quirky, slightly neurotic doctor who moves to a small, homey Alaskan town for a job, and in the process, learns how to let go, enjoy life, and fall in love, of course. While it may sound a bit predictable on paper, the movie stands out as a Christmas classic due to the corny but perfect perfect love story and picturesque scenery. There's really nothing better to watch at Christmas time than two people falling in love under the northern lights. The first thing you should know about Mr. Miracle is that it's based on a novel of the same name by Debbie Maycomer. If you like Hallmark, you probably know who Maycomer is. She's written several best-selling books and her popular series Cedar Cove went on to become a hit TV series on Hallmark. According to Hallmark, her books are about compelling relationships that embrace family and enduring friendships, uplifting her readers with stories of connection and hope. So, knowing that, you can already guess that the vibe of Mr. Miracle is cheerful, uplifting, and focused on hope and family. But the movie has much more to it. The storyline focuses on a struggling young woman named Addie, played by Britt Irvin, who meets a quirky English teacher, played by Rob Morrow, who just so happens to secretly be a guardian angel. From there, the bumbling guardian angel helps Addie find her way in life, just in time for Christmas. Morrow's acting is admittedly over the top, and some IMDb reviewers disliked his character, calling him obnoxious and goofy, while others appreciated the movie's heartfelt message. Either way, if you're looking for a Hallmark Christmas movie that's a little different but still full of festive vibes, this one is worth a watch. The Christmas House is a movie that takes place at Christmas time and revolves around decking the family house in a seasonal decor. But at the end of the day, it's really about family. Starring Robert Buckley, Anna Ayora, Treat Williams, Jonathan Bennett, and Brad Harder, the movie centers on a family that has to make some difficult decisions. As the Hallmark Channel puts it, bringing the family together will help them find resolution and make a memorable holiday for the entire family and community. The plot is sweet and sentimental, but what really stands out about this Christmas movie is that there are two gay leads. Played by Jonathan Bennett and Brad Harder, this couple is in the process of adopting their first child. Their story is emotional and realistic, and it's great to see Hallmark, a network known for its traditional family values, give some representation to the LGBTQ community. The Christmas House does a great job of being a feel-good holiday movie with some fun and surprising touches, including humor. Hallmark isn't necessarily known for its humor, but several IMDb reviewers report laughing out loud at this movie. Diverse cast, lovable characters, Christmas cheer, and humor? Yep, we're calling this one a winner. Well, then my work here is done.
It's a few days before Christmas. We are cozied up on the couch drinking some hot cocoa as snow falls lightly outside your window, and the only thing that's missing is a sweet, simple, and festive Christmas movie. Enter Jingle Bell Bride. This Christmas movie stars Julie Gonzalo as a big city, workaholic wedding planner named Jessica Perez. She has to make a quick trip to a remote town in Alaska to find the perfect floral arrangement for one of her celebrity clients. While she's there, she meets a cutie at the flower shop named Matt, played by Ronnie Rowe. He helps her feel at home in the small Alaskan town. As the two get to know each other, a romance blooms. Yes, it is another Hallmark Christmas movie centered around a small-town meet-cute, but the combination of the main character's playful chemistry, the festive setting, and the diverse cast make this one a must-watch. Starring Rochelle Aitz and Mark Taylor, A Christmas Tree Grows in Colorado focuses on Aitz Erin, who is the mayor's daughter and in charge of the town's Christmas festivities. She realizes that she needs a picture-perfect tree for the town's celebration and spots it in a handsome man's yard as he's building a snowman with his daughter. From there, Erin tracks the man down and finds out he's a firefighter named Kevin. Between snow angels and Christmas cookies, a magnetic romance begins to blossom between the two. This festive movie doesn't have the highest ratings compared to some other Christmas classics, but the leading actors play convincing characters with chemistry, and the plot is as predictably cute as you'd expect. Plus, there's plenty of gorgeous, Christmassy mountain scenery to set the scene. IMDb reviewers also praise the nostalgic Christmas music that plays throughout. Noelle Next Door is great for several reasons, but a major one is that the storyline feels real and relatable. It's still a Hallmark movie, of course, so there's nothing too gritty about the plot, but it does focus on a single mom and waitress Noelle, played by Natalie Hall. She wants to give her young son a good Christmas despite a difficult divorce, annoying neighbors, and other issues going on in life. Not only is Noelle Next Door a refreshingly real Hallmark Christmas movie, but there are also some twists and turns that may surprise you. No one can say the plot for this one is predictable. Additionally, the winter setting looks believable, with real snow and frosty air coming from the characters' mouths during outdoor conversations. These little details take Hallmark movies to the next level, as unrealistic settings can be distracting when you're trying to get in that holly jolly Christmas headspace. Overall, IMDb reviewers were very impressed with this one, with one person saying of the movie, with an extremely well-written script with dialogue that is clever and true to life. This may be the best of Hallmark's 2022 Christmas crop. We simply cannot pass up a Hallmark Christmas movie featuring Tia Mori of Tia and Tamara. In a gingerbread romance, Tia plays the main character, Taylor, an architect who is looking to settle down and find her own home. She gets put on a team with a pastry chef, Annabelle, for her workplace's gingerbread making contest. But the two do not get along. This leads to Annabelle quitting the contest altogether. Taylor panics and convinces a local baker, Adam, to join her team. As Taylor and Adam become closer, it's clear that the two make a great team, and love is very much in the air. A gingerbread romance may be a little corny, but there's a gingerbread house-making contest, a cute love interest, and plenty of wholesome family Christmas vibes. Though this one comes in with an average IMDb rating of 5.5, it's one of our favorite underrated Hallmark Christmas movies. If you're looking for a cute, sentimental film that gives some representation to those who celebrate both Christmas and Hanukkah, we may have found it. In Love Lights Hanukkah, the main character, Christina, played by Mia Kirshner, is a restaurateur whose adoptive mother has recently died. Processing her grief, Christina wants to learn more about her background, so she takes a DNA test and finds out she's Jewish, leading her to discover more about her biological family and herself. Christina is a huge Christmas fan, but she also has the opportunity to learn more about Hanukkah as she connects with her biological family. People have not necessarily loved Hallmark's Hanukkah movies in the past, but it seems that this film has been much better received. Writing for Insider, Talia Luckritz noted, "...the Jewish aspects of the film feel authentic. The film treats Hanukkah as more than just a foil to Christmas. The miraculous nature of the holiday is an overarching theme of the film." It's kind of interesting straddling two holidays. Welcome to my world.